Good morning. My name is Robin and today I'll be taking you along for a day here at University College Twente. This is where I live and this is where I study. Being a residential college, most of the UCT students live and work in the same building. Hi. Morning, Paula. Good morning. Are you ready to go for our lecture? Sure. Where are we off to? Social sciences. Right. Off we go. Paula, coming from Poland, why did you choose to study here at UCT? Well, I really want an international and diverse community. That's what perfect UCT is perfect for that because we have a lot of international students who have different interests. I also really wanted to combine technology with social sciences. That's why Atlas is a perfect choice. Great. Hey, Pascal. Hey, Robert. Hi. Good to see you. This is Pascal, and he's a social science lecturer here at UCT. Pascal, what do you think of UCT and the students? Well, I think UCT and the students are amazing. I mean, I like, really love our small, vibrant community, and of course, I mean, your ability to build your own academic profile. How great is that? Yeah, I agree. So we're going to class. Yeah, sounds good. Let's go. my lectures, I like to visit my study association, Atlantis. Now, Nina, as our chair, I'm sure you can tell us what Atlantis is and what Atlantis does. Atlantis is a study association of Atlas, so we organize fun events for activities for our members and we also do educational stuff. We offer books for a cheaper price. It's all a fun bubble, actually. Ah, great. Next up, I have a project meeting. Now, projects play a really big part of our educational program. Hi guys! Hi. So, this is my project group. Catherine, can you tell us what we're working on today? Yeah, so we're in our semester four project and the theme is Wicked Problems. So today we're taking a look at the Lake Chad Basin Crisis and we'll be specifically looking at refugees within the crisis. Yeah. Okay, sounds good, sounds good. Uh, Walter, what do you like about project-based learning? What I really like about project-based learning is that you learn how to apply the knowledge you have in meaningful projects. Now, in our team, of course, we need someone to manage and lead us. Kyla, what's your role within our team? Within our team, I'm the team leader. So I make sure uh, we know the deadlines, we finish the deadlines in time, and we have a fun time while we learn a lot. Well, we're definitely in safe hands with Kyla. Right, I've got to get back to work now. Working on projects like this one really gives me a lot of energy. And that's good because we're now off to our next appointment. The final meeting of today is with Kishore, my mentor. We meet every other week to discuss my academic, professional and personal life. It's really nice to have such close contact with a member of the teaching staff. Hey Kishore. Hey Rob. I was just talking about the fact that you're my mentor. What do you think of the mentoring program here at UCT? Indeed, mentoring is one of the unique opportunities at UCT that enables teachers to develop deeper understanding uh, about students and also it provides a great platform for students to express their personal needs and academic interests. So I think it is one of the uh, very rare uh, spaces where I can be very useful in uh, giving personalized attention to students. So I'm very happy being a mentor yeah. and especially to have excellent mentees like you. Oh, great, that's so kind of you, thank you. All right, enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you very much, <laughs> welcome. After a busy day like today, it's important to relax and unwind. To do that, there are many opportunities here at the campus. But for now, we're going to see my band and we're going to play some music. That's it for today. I hope you enjoyed following me around. If you have any more questions about UCT or the Atlas program, feel free and come visit us.